Hey, what's up, guys? MGH here. Welcome back to the RB Leipzig career mode. Today is the final episode of season one. And of course, we have the Champions League final. I still can't believe I'm saying that. First off, though, we have Dortmund. They are currently two points clear at the top of the table. And do you know what? I was thinking before I hit record, I actually want Dortmund to win the league. I think it would be really cool. So I'm actually kind of sad that I'm going to try and beat them. You know, I obviously want to try and get third place, which Bayern hold at the moment. They're one point above us. If I win my final two games in the Bundesliga, then I reckon we should get third. I reckon we'll get lucky. But of course, it doesn't mean anything. We can't win the league. Everything is about the Champions League final. So for this game against Dortmund, we will use the first team, pretty much the whole first team. But of course, against Augsburg, there is no chance. I'm using that second team to avoid any injuries any problems that could arise for the game against Barcelona, which is just two weeks after that. So let's go ahead and play Dortmund now. If we pick up a win, you just never know. It's very possible that Bayern will lose one of their next two games. It, it could happen, unlikely, but we'll see. And then, of course, it will be the Champions League final. And it could be the end of the series. If if I win the Champions League final, there's no way I'm continuing this, this journey with RB Leipzig. But also, even if I lose, I don't know. I've already talked about it in the last episode. This doesn't feel like a, a long... I don't know. It, it doesn't feel like it's my career mode. I, I can't explain it. It's It's been a weird season. I've really enjoyed using the team. But I think I'm ready for something different. So maybe we go for a road to glory. Or maybe we go for some football manager. I... I don't know. I don't know if I want to do Football Manager. I might just do that on stream. So make sure you're following me on Twitch. The link is in the description. But let's go ahead and get into the game against Dortmund now. And as I said, we will be using pretty much the entire first team because it would be silly not to. So we're going to go ahead and... Actually, that's the second team there. Let's switch over. So we'll take out Klosterman because he's uh, a, little bit, a little bit tired there. We'll go with... Do you know what? Should I bring in Mukiele? I, I will, you know. mukiele has been good every time we played him. I'm going to stick with Werner and Haaland. We are going to go with a 4-4-2 today. And I think that's fine. That's the team we're going to go ahead and use here. Hopefully Dortmund play a really strong team as well. This could be a very close game. I would just like to mention, by the way, I have been awake for approximately 45 minutes. I never record this early. I always record kind of like early afternoon and at the moment it's kind of mid-morning, late morning. So I'm a little bit sleepy still. I need to wake myself up. Go on, get it in the box. Okay, wasn't the best cross ever. Dest should pick it back up again into Tovan again. Let's get a cross in again. It's not bad at all. Holland was there. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Wow. Brandt has just scored... An absolute worldie. Just look at this. The curve on it. Oh, I mean, that is incredible. That's his weaker foot as well, isn't it? I think he's got, what, four-star weak foot, so it's not it's not too bad, but come on. How, how am I ever going to win this game if goals like that are going to be going in? <laughs> it's going to be interesting. We'll try and get back in this game as soon as we can. We're going to put Rodrigo in over the top here, and he's not going to get there. Up against Hakimi. Both players on loan from Real Madrid. We've won it back here. Go on. Oh. Campbell. Oh. Tovan. Holland. Why are you shooting? I tried to bloody cross it. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm just so confused. I, I need to see what happened here. Did it come off the post? He freaking headed it off the line. I've never, ever seen this in my life. Oh, my God. It's not the goalkeeper. <laughs> I thought it was the keeper. Oh, my God. I got so confused there. I thought Berkey headed it off the line and didn't catch it. My God. I'm actually blind. Oh, no. They're in behind. My God. What a game this has been so far. Here is Gaia and Tovan getting back with the defensive work. Let's go. Bayern have scored 27 minutes in. They are 1-0 up. It's not looking good at the moment, is it? We're losing here, and Bayern are winning up winning up over the, at Freiburg. Or were they at home? I think they were at home, weren't they? Piszczek is retiring. Interesting. What a player he's been for, for Dortmund. Oh, no. This could be bad. Oh, big save. 
Oh, Brandt, stop it. What a game he's having. Finally, we come away with it, though. Go on, Rodrigo. Oh, what was that pass? That was really bad from me. I tried to just slip Rodrigo through there. He was in very good space, but it was just a bad ball. And now Hakimi has passed it back. He could have carried on running there. Oh, my God. Bayern have made it 2-0. There's no way they're losing today. So even if I turn this game around, I'm still going to be in fourth place. Oh, my God. They've almost scored again, though. I'm being hammered right now. Got to make something count here. Come on. Let's go. Into Max. I don't want to cross it. It hasn't been working in this game. Here's Werner now. Oh, my God. Give me some space, will you? Holland. To Tovan. Just working it around the edge of the box here. And it comes to nothing. Wait, no. We got a free kick. Okay. Top right corner. And we're going to whip it inside. Um... Yeah. Why did I think that would work? I don't know. That's the end of the first half. It's not going to plan, that's for sure. What is that? Oh, my God. That is shocking. Mukiele. Oh. They could easily be winning this game 3 or 4 nil. Wait, what? Why am I getting a yellow card? Yeah, 2 nil. Oh, man, right before the Champions League final, I don't need to be playing this bad. OK, I don't need this right now. Please, game. Please. Matt, just wake up. I can't, I cannot use the excuse of playing FIFA a little bit earlier in the day. It doesn't work like that. I'm going to have to make a change, though. The 4-4-2 is not working. I'm used to the 4-2-3-1 at the moment. We're going to go with that. And do you know what? I'm putting Haaland up top. Werner is coming off. He hasn't had a very good game. We're going to bring in Nkunku. We're also going to take off Campbell and bring in Barco at Cam. We need a bit more pace up front that can get in behind, maybe from a deeper position. The two strikers and the two wingers just was not working. We've only got, what, 25 minutes, I'm guessing? 30 minutes to score three goals. Fourth place it is, lads. If you think I'm playing 4-4-2 against Barcelona, you must be mad. No chance. We're going 4-2-3-1 for that game. Here's Sancho now. Over to Hakimi. They're going to score again. I can feel it. Here it comes now. Paco's in. Oh, okay. Mukiele redeems himself from his earlier mistake. That was a very good block. Well, I can definitely see why Dortmund are winning the league. They have been unbelievably good in this game. They really have. That was a poor ball from Haaland there. I just have not been able to get anything through their defence. They are absolutely solid. Maybe once or twice I had a chance, but really, I've had nothing this entire game. Maybe now. See to Tovan on the right side. Oh, my God. Max, you're better than that. That was not a good ball. That, that should be it now. Can we just blow the whistle and end this game? What a painful match. It's been one of the worst, honestly. I really, really, really needed a win here, but maybe now we'll get the win against Barcelona, right? That's how FIFA works. You, you lose one, you win one. Oh, no, that means it's Augsburg. We'll win against them and then lose against Barcelona. <laughs> I'm not jinxing it. I'm not going to talk about it. Let's just get this Bundesliga season done. It's been disappointing. And confirmation that Bayern won. 3-0 there. Fair enough. They deserve to get third place. It is done. We cannot finish any better than fourth. Or any worse than fourth. That is our position with one game to go. And Dortmund have won the league. That's it. It is done. So congratulations to Dortmund. And um, we go into the next game with nothing to play for. So we'll go ahead and sim it with the second team. Doesn't look like we're going to get Ampadu or Des to 74 before the Champions League final. Not that they're going to be playing in that anyway. But let's go ahead and get to that game against Augsburg. Um... Yeah, second team, simulate. Let's do it. And hopefully we'll end the season with a win, though. And a 4-1 win. I should have just simmed against Dortmund, shouldn't I? Because clearly I can't play. <laughs> Schick, Kuhnha and Forsberg getting the goals there. That's, that's very decent. A 4-1 win to seal the end of the season. But now, of course, we have the Champions League final coming up. And I am nervous after that game. I cannot play like that against Barcelona. Right, so as I discussed, 4-2-3-1. Werner up top, Rodrigo and Tovan on the wings. 
Campbell and Lima in midfield, and I'm going to go with Barco. Every time I've used Barco at Cam, I've been really impressed with him. So why not? You know, I've got nothing to lose. I am the massive underdog here. Klosterman, Canate, Upamecano, Max. Yeah, I, I don't need to make any other changes to this team. I'm happy with the bench as well. Let's up the game time to five minutes each half because, of course, that's gives you a bit more of a chance, maybe. Maybe I'll be able to get a goal if I absolutely need it in the final dying minutes of this game. Here we go, guys. Here goes nothing. This is it. The Holy Grail. And I'm here in season one. Madness. Mainly because of this man, I would say. He may not be top scorer in the Champions League for us, but he has been getting massively important goals. Coming up against Liverpool, Man City, we were able to clutch it. But against Barcelona, I, <laughs> I don't know, guys. We're going to see how we get on, but my... My confidence isn't at an all-time high right now after that terrible game against Dortmund. And the fact that we finished fourth in the Bundesliga really isn't very good. We should be winning the Bundesliga, really, I think, anyway. Especially if we're able to get to the Champions League final. It's a bit of a mismatch, isn't it? But either way, good start here with some possession. Let's go ahead and check the team because I want to show you guys that they've made some interesting signings. They've gone with Rashford up top with Dembele on the left, Messi on the right. They've gone with De Jong, Arthur and Neves. What a signing that is. Kyle Walker at right back. Umtiti, Longley, Alba and Tostegan. So, yeah, some really interesting signings there. Rashford in particular up front, replacing Suarez. Messi, of course, is the player to watch, as we almost lost it there. I think if we can get an early chance, that'd be great. Here's Barco now. Good turn. Hit it. Okay. We've hit the post within eight minutes. I'm not going to complain. That's still a good start. But if that went in, I would have been considerably excited. Rashford, heavy touch. Thank you very much. And we've got it back. This is really good start so far. Here's Tovan. Come on. Werner, put it through for Rodrigo. There we go. I'm just going to go with the first time cross here. No way. No, he hasn't missed that. He hasn't. No. Oh, he has missed it. I thought it took a deflection. I cannot believe that. What a start. I... <laughs> what can I say? Here come Barcelona on their first attack. It is going to be Dembele on this left side. Plays it back to Jordi Alba. Just going to chase the ball down. Oh, thank you very much. I'll take that. Here's Werner again. I still cannot believe we missed that chance. That was a goal in, in any other game. It just had to be the Champions League final that we mess it up. Klosterman inside to Lima, who's been one of my favourite players this season. I really rate Lima highly. Now here's Tovan. He's, he hasn't got the pace. Cut inside. Barco gets the shot off, but it is blocked by Longley. And here come Barcelona again. They haven't really done too much with it. Messi, I think that might be just his second or third touch this game. He has not been involved, but that's a great ball. And he's going to keep it in as well. Rashford's damn quick. Upamecano, though, does very well to get the tackle in. Let's block all options here for the throw. Oh, I was not quick enough for that one. De Jong's going to cross it. That's a foul, isn't it? No? Okay, then. Thank you very much, Ref. Maybe he's going to be kind to us today. Here they come again, though. Rashford. Canate's done so well there. I almost missed it. And he would have been through on goal. That's how close this game could be. A moment like that and just a lapse in concentration or just a simple defensive mistake. And I could, I could concede. It is quite literally that easy. But again, whenever we've got the ball, we do look pretty good. Barcelona don't seem to be able to contain us. All in for Werner. Oh, my God. To Stegen with the save. Please chest that. No, I was hoping he would control it. But now Barcelona on the counter again. Look at it. I'm in the bottom right corner. Did you see my little gold jacket? I tell you what, I look good for the final. You know, if we lift that trophy, I'm going to be looking good on the sidelines in my, in my gold jacket, you know. It's not quite a gold trophy, though. We'll take that. It's not an Invincibles trophy, which, my God, Liverpool could actually get that this year. Why am I thinking about that right now? We're in a Champions League final. OK, we need to focus here. Lima picks it up. Oh, what a drive this could be. Go on the inside. Give it to Barco. It's Rodrigo. Oh, I tried to do the fake shot and get around him. Didn't quite work out. Messi is still quick. 
even though he's, what, 47 now? Unbelievable. Oh, my God, no. No, no, that could be a red. No, don't. That's not a red card. It, it shouldn't be. Yellow maximum. It is a yellow. Just for a second there, the way the referee started running, I thought, oh, no. That would have been game over. I might be in trouble, though, because Campbell... Oh, that was a bad... Bad free kick from Messi. Campbell's a big part of my midfield. He does get back a lot, so I'm going to make, I'm gonna have to be really careful. Don't want to be sliding in with him anymore. We've got a couple of minutes here. Let's try and get a ball over the top for Tovan. What a ball that is. Holy crap, that was good. Give it to Klosterman on the inside. Oh, we almost got him in. We're going to keep it in, though. We'll give that to Lima. Two minutes of added time. Into Barco. Into Werner. Back to Barco. And Titi is there. That will be the end of the first half. It has actually been a very good game for us. Miles better than the one against Dortmund. So, I don't know. I don't know what the next 45 minutes will bring. But so far, so good. I'm actually making a massive decision at halftime. I've taken Campbell out. That yellow card was stressing me out. There's no way I was going to risk getting a red card. So Nkunku has come on. Very similar player. He's good going forward and he's good defensively. So I don't think we'll miss Campbell too much. But that's a bold decision to use up a sub at halftime purely because of a yellow card. Just because I had a bad feeling. You know, I just, I just had a feeling that it would end up in tears. So I've made the decision and just done it early. Here is Dembele now. Not a great touch from him. Well done, Klosterman. He's having a very good game as well against Dembele. Not letting him get anything going. Here's Barco. Tried to give it to Werner. But Neves, man, what a what a player he is. What a weird signing. I've never seen Neves go to Barcelona in a career mode before. But why not? He's that, he's that kind of player. You know, he's really good with his feet. Oh, no. He's offside. It's fine. He's come back onside. Oh, my God. Barcelona, mate. That was beautiful play. Just for a moment there. I think it was De Jong. He was in. All they had to do was look up and get the pass. But instead, now we're going down this right side up against Jordi Alba. Torvan. Put it inside. Okay, we've got it again. And again inside. Now through. Into the box. And Titi was there again. He's also having a very good game. And they've just taken off Rashford and brought on Griezmann. In the 60th minute. I know that's not too early, but that's, that's still... That's a bold move. So Griezmann is now on. Why wasn't he starting ahead of Rashford? Oh, my God. And I've just given them the ball. Okay. That does complicate things a little bit. I would much rather play against Rashford, I think. Or would I? I don't know. Rashford is definitely quicker and a bit more direct than Griezmann. But Griezmann is the better footballer by a distance, I would say. Oh, no. They're starting to really put some pressure on. My players are all over the place. Come on. Get a challenge in there. He's going to shoot. He's going to shoot. Oh, my God. They're not even celebrating with him. Okay, EA. We are now in January 2020. I'm in a Champions League final. De Jong has just scored to make it 1-0. And no one celebrates with him. Okay. Your game is broken. Broken. And now I'm a broken man because we're 1-0 down. And I would say that's unfair. Because I've been playing good football, okay? I don't deserve to be losing this game. But now I need to find two goals. Yep. There's no way I'm letting this go to penalties because I know I will lose on pens. Oh, my God. That was close. And that was a stupid pass from me. 20 minutes to go. I'm going to make a change. We've got to... Jeez, uh... who do I bring on, though? Okay, let's bring in Sabitzer. And that's it for now. Just in case we get an injury or something. Or if it goes to extra time, we've then got an extra sub. So... We'll, we'll, we'll play it safe here. Give that to Lima. Oh, my God. He's got it. What? Play on. What? How is that a foul against them? You are kidding me. And now they're bringing on Oyazab Oyaza Oyazabal. <laughs> I don't know how to say his name. What a player he is as well. He's going to be going on that left side. Of course, we've got Sabitzer on. Oh, God. This is going to get even more difficult now. A tricky winger like that. Or Yazabal. Oh, oh, no. Okay. That should have been 2-0. I'm going to take that as a sign that we should be 
countering them, but no. We're going to give it away straight away. Try and defend this. Oh, no. They're starting to toy with me, guys. Come on. Oh, I, I can't read where they're going. Normally, I'm pretty good at doing that. I know when they're going to turn. I know which direction they're going to turn to, but for some reason, I'm struggling here. Okay, this is good. Go on, Werner. Make a run, then. Get in behind. Here's Rodrigo. A chance to run the defence. Good. He's showing good pace here. Oh, my God, though. Jordi Alba, he just took a step back at the perfect time. Oh, and that's going to be a yellow card as well. We've got 10 minutes left. And it's not looking good for us. If anything, Barcelona are just getting stronger and stronger. One on Klosterman, but he hasn't kept it. Yes, Lima. No, 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 no. Yeah, we got it. Oh, okay. This is it, guys. This is the moment. This is where we score. Nice. Into Sabitzer. Little one to Averna, maybe. Here we go. He's not very quick, though. No, um, Titi. Why? Give a pen. Foul me. What a beautiful tackle that was. You, you can't be angry at that. It's just perfect tackle. Right. Well done, Nkunku. Good job. We go again. Sabitzer could be through again. Yes, he is. He's just too slow, though. Why did I take off Barco? He would have been so good in those positions just to get through. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, we've got it again. This is it now. I've got to make this count. Oh. <sighs> I'm useless. Why did I pass that across the field? Like I don't know why I did that. I, I, I literally have no idea what came into my head to do that pass. Now they're just going to keep the ball. That's it. It's, it's game. It is game. I cannot believe this. Oh, man. I'm so gutted with that. But they deserve it. Their, their goal was really good. They made some really, really good chances. I just didn't. I just didn't. Umtiti, man of the match for me. Easily. He was so good in defence. De Jong in midfield as well. Wow. What a player. But that ultimately is the end of the season. And we've won nothing. <laughs> nothing. So if I was to continue, I might. I don't know. But Werner will be going. That was my promise. I said Werner would be going if I didn't win a trophy. This was the last one left. And it just wasn't to be. They were very, very good. I've got to give it to them. Very, very good. And now we're going to see... Wait, why isn't Messi captain? He is captain, right? Why is Stegen going up like he's, going to about, he's about to lift it? There we go. Lionel Messi is going to lift up the Champions League again. What a player. What a man. And what a team. Well done, Barcelona. Got to give it to them. Very well played. They dominated and they deserve to win. And they won, I think it was 7-2 on aggregate in the semi-finals. I mean, that's pretty incredible. But that, I, I think that's it, guys. I I don't know how, how I feel about carrying on. It was a fun season with RB Leipzig. They're a really fun team. But I wouldn't recommend them for a career mode because the team is, is very well sorted already. They've got a lot of great young players. There's not many changes you need to make. And that doesn't make for a good career mode. And I should have seen that coming after doing this for almost 10 years. So thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, please do leave a like rating. And if you want me to do another season, then just leave your comments down below. But I am already thinking of doing some type of road to glory, taking a team from the bottom to the top, using the Youth Academy system and doing a proper, proper career mode. This was fun, but it wasn't it. It wasn't the right decision in the end. But I still had fun, and hopefully you guys did too. And I will see you in the next video soon.